Well, every penny saved at the pump counts, especially for Meals on Wheels. KFDM's Haley Boole reports a drop in the price of gasoline is welcome news for the delivery service, already straining to cut costs. Hey, sweetie. How Meet are Joyce you? and Jean. These Meals on Wheels volunteers are spending their morning delivering Good lunch to morning. seniors. Joyce has been at it for 12 years. I, I live alone with my pets. Sure, I have time. So I get up and go. Beats the heck out of watching those lint balls roll around the floor, you know. They're feeding seniors who don't have another way to get lunch. It's a matter of giving back, and someday I may need this. So that's where my heart is. Meals on Wheels makes 1,100 deliveries each day, and that uses up a lot of gas. Meals on Wheels is traveling what they describe as an area the size of Harris County. So these new low gas prices are providing some much needed relief. Anywhere we can get relief from costs, that is just a, you know, such a blessing. Uh, it's nice to see it go down. You know, 2008 when it went to $4 a gallon, we just didn't know exactly how we were going to cover that cost. So yes, it's, it's a real relief to see it go down. Relief that's critical now that they're bracing for federal funding cuts. We have eliminated staff. And uh, we're looking at all of our cost and trying to reduce cost where every pan. With volunteers driving 12 to 15,000 miles a week, every dollar counts for the seniors getting lunch and for the woman delivering. These aren't uh, the nutrition clients. They're my Thursday and Friday morning friends. Thank you. You have a blessed day. Honey. In Beaumont, Haley Bull, KFDM 6 News. The Meals on Wheel Executive Director says the program will rely more and more on community support, but there are no plans to cut services.